share with you something really fun and exciting that I have been waiting on. So a few weeks ago, my family came to visit me at the feed store I work at, and we had just got in praying mantids, and we talked about it, we researched it, we wanted to know what are praying mantids. Well, they are an insect that you actually can release in your garden and they will eat all of the bad bugs that are eating your produce and your vegetables and the ones that are detrimental to your garden. So we picked one up. It was basically just the egg case which houses about 100 to 200 eggs and we brought it home. We left it sit on our counter where it's somewhat warm in our house and usually they take about three to ten weeks to hatch. Well, I got home tonight from work. It's been almost four weeks of it sitting on our kitchen counter. I picked it up to see if anything was going on and boom! I've got like over a hundred of these little mantids that hatched. So here we are this evening. We're actually going to release them out in our garden and let them grow up and let them start eating some of these bad bugs that are eating my strawberries, eating our apple trees, and just see if maybe this will help out. So let's go ahead and we're gonna put them in the strawberry patch and I'm gonna show you guys what they look like. Here's my strawberry patch, you guys. This is where I'm gonna release the mantids. Just so tonight when they come out of the cup, they're well protected. No other flyover bugs are going to get them. And within hopefully a few weeks, we'll be seeing these guys putting on some size. And I'll do an update video if I see any of them hanging out out here and show you guys what they look like when they become full grown. Now, one thing I have learned about these guys, the moment they hatch in the cup, once all of them are out, as many that are going to hatch, you got to get them out of here. Otherwise, they do start to eat each other because they are that aggressive towards other bugs. So, Allie, if you want to come on in, I'm going to take the lid off and show you guys what these look like once they first hatch. And these did just hatch some point today while I was at work. All right, you guys. So, I'm taking the lid off. I'm going to open this a little bit better. There we go, you guys. They just hatched today. Look at all of that. I mean, there's got to be at least a couple hundred of these in here. This is amazing. Emily, you want to get one on your hand? There you go. All right, so what we're going to do, I'm just going to set this cup down into my strawberry patch here, kind of where there's a little bare spot where I can actually walk. I'm going to show you guys. I'm going to put some in my hand here. Look at that. Let's make sure they don't go up my shirt, huh, guys? This is pretty neat. All right, little guys. I'm going to get you off of me now before I start getting the creepy crawlies. So there you go, guys. I just wanted to share this with you. I thought it was really super cool. These guys are awesome. Look at that. They look like baby mosquitoes, but they won't stay small for long. All right, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this. I am going to watch these guys grow because I've never seen a full-grown one. I don't know if you have or not. Let me know. And we'll see you in the next video. And thanks for watching. Have a good night, you guys.